Hi everyone, I am Arun Julkar. Today we will learn relationship between nominal effective and force of interest and how to calculate effective and force of interest when the nominal rate of interest is given to you using spreadsheet. Effective rate is equals to 1 plus R upon M whole ratio power M minus 1 where R is nominal rate of interest, M is number of times interest compounded in a year. Now in this first example, what effective rate is equivalent to the nominal rate of interest 9% converted quarterly. Here nominal rate is given 9%, M is 4 because interest converted quarterly and now we want to calculate the effective rate using this formula. We use this formula equal 1 plus rate of interest divided by M whole is the power M minus 1 enter and the answer is 9.31%. This 9.31% is equivalent to the nominal rate of interest 9% which is converted quarterly. One more example. In this example, what effective rate is equivalent to the nominal rate of 7.02% converted monthly? Here nominal rate is 7.02%, M is 12 because interest converted monthly and now we want to calculate effective rate of interest. Formula is equal 1 plus rate of interest divided by m whole is the power m minus 1 enter and the answer is 7.25 percent reverse of that how to calculate nominal rate of interest when the effective rate is given to you the formula is 1 plus re re is for the effective rate the whole ratio power 1 by m minus 1 and the whole multiply by m what nominal rate of rate compounded monthly is equivalent to the effective rate 7.25 percent. In this example effective rate is given 7.25 m is 12 because interest compounded monthly and now we're going to calculate nominal rate of interest. Formula is equal 1 plus effective rate whole is to the power 1 divided by m minus 1 and this whole multiply by m answer is 7.02 percent one more example what nominal rate compounded quarterly is equivalent to the effective rate of 9.31 percent effective rate is 9.3531 percent m is 4 because interest compounded quarterly and now we want to calculate nominal rate of interest we use the same formula equal 1 plus effective rate whole is to the power 1 divided by m minus 1 and this whole multiplied by m enter the answer is 9 percent next now we want to calculate effective rate of interest when the force of interest is given to you. Force of interest means when the interest compounded continuously. Here, force of interest is 7% and we want to calculate the effective rate of interest. The formula of effective rate of interest is e raised to the power r minus 1. e raised to the power means we use exponential r and r is force of interest. We use this formula here equal exponential force of interest minus 1. The answer is 7.25 percent. So we reduce up to two decimal place. One more example we want to calculate the effective rate of interest where the force of interest is given 8 percent. We use this formula equal exponential force of interest minus 1 enter answer is 8.33 percent when we reduce up to three decimal two decimal places and the reverse of that reverse means when the force we want to calculate force of interest when the effective rate is given to you and the formula for the force of interest is log base 10 1 plus re the whole divide by log base 10 e raised to power 1 e raised to power 1 means exponential 1 and we use this formula here. Here, effective rate is given 8.33 percent. We want to calculate the force of interest. We use this formula equal log base 10 
1 plus effective rate divided by log b is 10 e raised to the power 1 means exponential 1 enter and the answer is 8 percent one more example where you want to calculate the force of interest when the effective rate is given 7.25 percent equal log b is 10 1 plus effective rate divide by log b is 10 exponential 1 means e raised to the power 1 enter and the answer is 7 percent